Hey everybody, welcome back. Jordan here. Today, we're going to be doing some Lego shopping. I actually find myself here in Kamloops, British Columbia. Absolutely gorgeous here. It's 40 degrees Celsius. It's almost like a little mountain town, but it's almost like a desert because it's so hot here in the summer. It's, it's beautiful. So today, we're going to be doing some Lego shopping. We're going to start our little adventure here at Walmart. Then we're going to go to Toys R Us. There's also a private Lego store here as well. That's like a toy store and they sell Lego. Have a little peek at their website. I believe it's called Tumbleweed Toys and it sounds like they have, or looks like they have some pretty good selection. Maybe we'll find some little retired gems there. Maybe we'll find some rollback prices here at Walmart. And then of course, great deals and maybe even some retired sets at Toys R Us. You just never know whenever I'm foreign, whenever I'm on foreign ground or in a city that I that I don't reside in. I've got to check out the, uh, the shopping locations just because you never know, right? Might find something good. So today, we're uh, in Kamloops, British Columbia, and we're doing some Lego shopping. Woohoo! All right, so here we go. It's the uh, Lego aisle here in Walmart. I think I've pre-scouted out maybe a deal or two that I might be interested in, so that's always good, right? We got our little Lego city section right here. Love this tractor recently built it, integrated it into the farm, which we're still building, but looks great. Also, we got the fire rescue helicopter here, $5 savings, so about 10% off. Generally looking for a better deal than that. This little monster truck here. Also the police bricks box, $5 off as well. The fire ladder trucks on sale, speedboat, little construction set. No dealios on speed champions, no new speed champions in stock. Got a little classic kit down here on sale. Got some of the uh, Hogwarts sets up top here. We got Hogwarts clock tower and then the uh, astronomy tower, I believe as well. Some video stuff. I still gotta get some video stuff so that we can uh, get some of those two by two printed tiles out of there. I honestly think that it would be great to get those and add those to our to our mocks. It's just to have some detail in the inside, maybe like snot brick them to the wall. And actually one mock that I'd like to include that little detail in would be the arcade. These are the two sets that are on somewhat of a good price. So the Minion, pilot training with the aircraft and Bob and Stuart is on sale for 29 Canadian dollars and it used to be 39.86 so you're saving about ten dollars there it's pretty good is that like 25 percent off and then this one here as well uh, was 25 dollars and it now is 14 dollars so that's well, like 40 percent off ish yeah look at him he's got the bubbles on him it's funny you get Otto and Kevin in here. Also a piece of roller coaster track and a slide, which would be fun to use to integrate into something. You know, if you were to build or get multiple of them, connect those roller coaster tracks and use those slides for something. Also get a whack of sticker elements in there, I would assume. That's something to consider. Looks like we had one here that's now sold out in the Disney section. We got some Super Mario stuff. Got an, another deal down here. That one was $79.86 and is now $59. Got great minifigures in there. Loki, Hulk, Thor, Iron Man, Captain Marvel. Might be good to get for the minifigs. And actually the uh, Mandalorian Battle Pack is on sale as well three dollars off that so that's about 15 percent roughly it's not a bad deal either actually then we've got some uh, small selection of star wars stuff here and uh, mandalorian child oh that must be where the brickheads were sold out of those i think the two deals that really piqued my interest here are the mandalorian battle pack that we just saw there and also the little minion set I might have to leave them at Walmart here. I don't know. $14 for that. Two minifigures slide, roller coaster rail, some pieces that I could use. You know what? I think I am going to get this one. I think it's a good call. 
We'll get some bananas. <laughs> Sweet. Oh, I think it's got some good pieces of it for 14 bucks. I really don't see anything wrong with that. And you know what? I think I'm going to get two of them. I'm going to get two of those. I feel like we could do something with those slides and that roller coaster rail. I don't know. Make something happen. Cool, I'm going to get two of those. Well, there we go. I guess that's the deal here at uh, Walmart. Pretty good, I think. Add some minions to the collection. Perfect. Let's roll on up to our next destination, which will be Toys R Us, I believe. All right, I got something else as well. I got this little dinosaur here for my nephew. And then for my niece, I got this here, which is like an Elsa Barbie. Yeah, that's pretty cool. And of course we got the minions too. Banana! Hello. Well, at first glance, they uh, actually do have some deals here, which is pretty exciting. Also, it's very neat and organized, well-faced, good looking Lego department for sure. Starting right here with Star Wars. So we got the AT-AT Walker, the X-Wing, all the helmets in the very top here, along with the probe droid, some battle packs, the Mandalorian Brickhead, Kylo Ren's command shuttle, some Ninjago stuff here. Also city. Tuning garage. Hey, there's one on a clearance. This one's regular $80 on sale for $63.98. Now we are in British Columbia, so there is a 7% PST that's gonna be added to the price compared to Alberta. Oh, this one also $10 off here. I feel like that's a pretty good deal, $16 off. Comes with some pretty cool elements there for like a car wash and some vehicles for your city too, which which would really work out, I guess, right? You always need more vehicles for a Lego city. The more pieces there are, the better it looks, right? Then actually over here, I've spotted a different deal, which is actually on base plates. So these are regular $10 here in Canada. They're on for $8.77, so you're saving just over 10%. And the green ones are actually saving, saving about 20%, but then there's that 7% PST, so it only uh, comes to about 13% off. But there's the classic base plates. Also, the large gray ones on the bottom here are, what, $4 off. Hey, that's pretty good. I might have to consider getting some base plates here because we just started the construction phase of the uh, scenes underneath the table which is going to take a ridiculous amount of base plates so i'm going to need to get base plates eventually and if they're on sale you may as well do it here's a 1500 piece classic set on for 63.97 you can get them cheaper at costco also all the three in one sets are 20 percent off so the pirate ship the camper van also the uh, townhouse pet shop cafe and one that I didn't see last time I was at Toys R Us is this one here, which is the monster truck burger truck. So you can get that 20% off, 55.97. That's 7% PST. I never even thought of that when we purchased that stuff at uh, Walmart there. But still, I think those minions were a pretty good deal. Then we got some uh, Harry Potter stuff here, of course. Really good selection here. Excellent selection, even some of the newer stuff, right? Excellent. Looks really good, looks really well faced, right? It's excellent. And then we've got uh, some Super Mario. I am, thank you. Super Mario, also Avengers and Marvel. Also, you got some road plates over here for regular price. So if you needed more T's and straights, I guess Toys R Us has them, $19.99, which is the standard price. We got some decisions to make here. Not sure if I want to get some of these classic base plates, maybe that monster truck. Got to think about it though. I just spotted this deal as well. This is regular $70 and it's on for $48.88. This is uh, Buzz and Woody's Carnival Mania from Toy Story. Comes with some great figures, also some great stuff that can be added to the amusement park. That might be pretty cool as well. So generally speaking, when I go to any city, I look for two different things. Lego and also Donut. So we find ourselves here at Donut King. So before we head to our next Lego shopping destination, we've got to get some donuts in us. Well, everybody, I got a whole dozen donuts. Woo, look at those. Now I'm going to bring them to my brother's work. 
All right, here's Tumbleweed Toys. Hey, it looks pretty cool from the outside for sure. All right, this is a pretty cool store. I like how it has like the open glass roof, pretty sweet. We've got a small selection of Lego here. Pretty decent though. I mean, there's like some newer stuff, some older stuff, stuff from all themes like Technic and Harry Potter and Ninjago and Marvel stuff and the helmets, base plates, all that stuff there. But I don't really see anything that's sort of catching my eye. So as they have a uh, books too that come with the exclusive minifigures. All right. I've never really collected those. I think the main reason you get them is for those exclusive figures, right? Amazing vehicles, Lego playbook, all done by DK. <laughs> we are back at Toys R Us. Yes. So we are going to get this because I think we can use this stuff here in our amusement park also. Pretty cool minifigures for sure. So we get those guys. Well, I guess we'll get that one. And then uh, thinking about the base plates even further over here, I need 40, no, I need 80 of these. And I think 20 of the gray ones. I think I'm going to save that for another time. <laughs> I could get the ones that they have here and even after the tax save about a dollar fifty per plate. Which is pretty good actually, thinking about that. But you can also order these on ToysRUs.ca and then I don't have to pay that extra 7%. So I'm going to leave that but I'm going to get this because this is not available online and I think it's going to be a great addition to the amusement park. So. Pretty excited about that. Look at all those great minifigs. That's excellent. I like it. I like this like octopus thing too. Ooh, look at that. It'd be cool to make little bumper cars using that design. Interesting. Very cool. So this I'm gonna get at Toys R Us today. So now we're back from uh, our little shopping adventure there in Kamloops in my brother's backyard here. Gonna enjoy the rest of this plus 40 day probably hop in the pool there maybe the hot tub probably not the hot tub though sounds like uh kids want to go in the pool though and they got their little toys there yeah so uh thanks for joining me on this little shopping trip and remember to like and subscribe and stay tuned for some more great stuff coming out here on the channel thanks for popping by and have a great one